<laughs> okay, so today I'm gonna help you get rid of your body aches. We all know that when we work out and maybe in the summertime we start to move more and with movement, that creates little tissue breakdown into your body. The harder you train or the more that you train, the more breakdown you're gonna get and it's gonna lead to more muscle soreness. So today I wanna give you three ways to get rid of your body aches. Number one is that I would tell you to move, just not as fast, okay? You don't, def like, you don't need a week off, okay? I'm telling you right now, I don't care who told you, you don't need a week off. What you need to do is stimulate blood flow, get the body moving, you just don't wanna lift as heavy or you don't wanna move as fast. So if your knees are sore, let's say you got like a tendinous issue, right? So your, your patellar tendon is sore or maybe you've been diagnosed with ITB syndrome. So your iliotibial band is tight and it has some inflammation in it. So the worst thing you can do is just sit at home, sit at your desk, work and do nothing because everything is gonna shorten, it's gonna tighten up and in fact, it's gonna get worse and it's gonna get even worse when you start to do activity. So what you need to do is get the body moving, just don't move as fast, don't lift as heavy, and maybe don't do any jumping. Number two is that you need to have a recovery routine planned. I personally see some type of massage, physio, athletic therapist, chiro, at least three times a month, okay? I make sure that that's pre-scheduled. You probably have benefits, you need to use them. You're paying for them, use them. They may not come off your check, but you are paying for them through your wages, okay? So start having a recovery team plan. Now, if you don't have the benefits and you don't have the income to support seeing a therapist, then have a recovery team plan in the sense of go and buy one of those massage guns. Like they're so cheap right now on Amazon, you could probably find one for like 30 bucks, okay? Get those massage guns, get into those IT bands, get into those quads every single night. Now, you probably have a bathtub, and if you have a bathtub, set yourself up with a nice hot bath. Get that blood flow going, okay? Once you get that blood flow going, the body heals itself. It's just like moving, right? So as soon as you get that hot bath in there, you're creating movement, you're circulating the blood, and you're stimulating a recovery routine. So have yourself a recovery routine either professionally or personally, but either way, if you can do both, you're gonna feel better and you're gonna see better results. And the number, one, number three thing is posture. Okay? A lot of people say, oh, I got this shoulder thing, I got this back thing, I got this knee thing. Well, a lot of that is coming from improper alignment of your body. So when it comes to your shoulders, think about it. We sit like this all day, right? We sit like this like all day, or we walk around like this all day, and we think that this is actually more comfortable for us, but there's studies out there that show that if your body's out of alignment, so your shoulders are down, your back is humped because your your stomach is like you know pushed in then what ends up happening is you actually burn more calories because things are out of alignment okay now that's good for weight loss but ultimately it's bad for your body because if you stay in this stretched and unawkward unorthodox position then guess what your body is working way too hard which over the course of time is going to create some type of pain for you because it's being overworked okay now it's not hardcore overwork like you you know being a pitcher and throwing a hundred balls but sitting in this position for a hundred days you're going to start to feel it and a small thing is going to turn into a big thing so there we have it three simple ways of how you can get rid of your body aches you need to move more a week off no forget about who told you i don't care what letters they have after their name don't take a week off, especially if it's something that's minor, like a little tenderness or muscular injury or, you know, like just overuse stuff, right? You can work through that. Just get your body going in a very slow motion. Number two is that you need to have a recovery routine plan, either professionally or personally. Go see a massage therapist or go have a hot bath. And number three, fix your posture, yo. Get your shoulders back, get your head back, get your body alignment, suck your belly button in, stand up nice and tall, be the person that you can be, and we'll see you on that next video.